My name is Okoche Samuel Peter, a proud alumnus of Ayute Africa Shaling Season 2. Guess what? Ayute Africa Shaling Season 3 is back. And this year, every innovator who makes it to the top 15 will have a chance to partake in the grand prize of the challenge. In 2023, I participated in Ayute Africa Challenge Uganda Season 2, where I emerged victorious as the overall winner with my innovation, the Smart Coco Brooder. The grant from AFA International was a turning point in my innovation journey. It was able to transform my innovation from a prototype level into a commercial product. We were able to set up a standard production unit in the district of Barara, where we are currently doing production. In the workshop, we have acquired state-of-the-art technologies and machinery to help us with our commercial production. We have been able to employ five active employees at our workshop premises and created jobs for dozens of years in the raw material supply value chain. To date, we have expanded our reach to most of the regions in Uganda, which includes Lira, Barara, and the Greater Tesu. This is where our impact has been felt the most, as is the regions where poultry is being done a lot in Uganda. In June 2024, I participated in Ayute Africa Next Generation Challenge. In this challenge, we were nominated from a group of 100 youth from all over Africa, and uh, the grand finale happened in Chigale, Rwanda. It has been a learning opportunity for me, and I really appreciate EFA International for offering such opportunity to the youth of Africa. I was able to network with fellow innovators from countries like Kenya, Nigeria, and Rwanda and share ideas. This has improved uh, my level of thinking about my innovation, has improved my capacity of working more in the innovation. To my fellow innovators, especially women out there, your dreams are valid, your ideas are valid, your innovations are valid. I encourage you to apply for Ayute Africa Challenge Uganda Season 3. Don't underrate your idea. Together, let us change Uganda. Give